10 guys, 10 girls, one house, and one shot at finding your one true love. Our matchmakers scoured the country, finding the absolute perfect connection for each of our contestants. But will they be able to detect their special someone? Let's meet the contestants. I'm Joey, I'm 31, and I'm a comedian in Los Angeles. In my spare time, I like being athletic and taking care of my body. Honestly, I suck at dating, and I'm really ready to meet my one true love. So how about it, MTV? Let's go. Let's bring in our first contestant, Joey. Welcome, Joey. How you feeling? I'm stoked. I am absolutely stoked. Well, don't get too excited because unfortunately, you are our only contestant. What? We were unable to locate your one true love. But you're supposed to set me up with my perfect match. Buddy, we tried. We interviewed over 500 potential matches, but none of their charts lined up with yours. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You're right. It was actually over 10,000 interviews of 10,000? You interviewed 10,000 people and none of them liked me? Dude, just wait. Just let me try to host the show. Just let me host the freaking show. Why did you bring me here then? Like, what am I doing here? Well, I thought it would be funny. You thought what would be funny? That you came out here all by yourself. You're alone on the couch. You think people are gonna wanna watch this? Yeah, look, love's cool, but people like watching depressed people too. Why do you think people like watching magicians? <laughs> okay, I mean, like, I wouldn't watch this show. Yeah, because it's happening to you! Shit! Shit! They're gonna fire me from this one too. Thanks a lot, man. Oh my god. Uh, I got kicked off the prices right because I kept telling people how much this shit costs. Man vs. Food canned my ass because the fucking food beat me. And Cash Cab kicked me to the cash curb because they were upset that I was charging people for rides. Yeah, that's why they fired you. Look, that all sounds really hard, but 10,000 people turned down TV appearances because I blow. It's really not that many people. It's like a town in New Hampshire. Get over yourself. My aunt's from New Hampshire. Well, then don't visit your aunt! I don't know what to tell you! This isn't all about you! It's a dating show and I'm the only contestant! Yeah, but I'm hosting it and I'm failing! Look at me! Dude. Fuck. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna cut to a commercial, okay? We're gonna rethink this whole show, okay? Coming back, smiles on our faces. Let's get those sponsors out. Sponsor? We don't have a sponsor. That means the show is canceled. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. It's happening to me again. It's just another, are you smarter than these twin boys? I wasn't smarter than them then, and I am not smarter than them now. Hey, that show is good. Thanks, man. What are you doing after this? I was gonna be here for like eight weeks. Oh yeah, so did I. I think the uh, I think the house is booked. Is the house booked? Can we stay? Oh. Hey, so we can stay. Look. I know it's not exactly what you were hoping for, but... Oh, having 10,000 people reject me on national television? Oh, you let that go already? I mean, geez, the sooner you stop feeling sorry for yourself, the sooner you can hang loose in this big empty house and make a new male adult friend. What? Me! You wanna hang out in this house with me and be friends? Stop being polite, start being real. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, I got all my stuff with me. Oh, sick. But aren't you worried that it's gonna be just like the real world? Oh, buddy, I've thought of that. And to that point, I have just one question for you. What's that? You mind if I take all my clothes off? I don't mind at all. Naked Roommates. Roommates that are naked. Friday nights at 8, 7 central.